BASF at K22. Welcome to our plastics journey and welcome to our very first creator talk for today, which is going to be about this beautiful piece of engineering. And I'm going to talk to Alexander Scheu from Heidelberger Druckmaschinen AG and from Jochen Solbert from BASF. Good morning, colleagues. How are you feeling? I'm fine, yeah. I'm fine. Thank you. Wonderful. Alexander, um, as I said, we're going to talk about this Connect Home wall box. But there's one thing I have to ask you. Your employer is actually Heidelberger Druckmaschinen AG. So you're doing printing machines and not wall boxes. How did you come about doing this one? Yeah, yeah. So Heidelberg um, is known since decades in the print media industry as a world market leader in uh, sheet fed offset printing. Mm -hmm. um, I'm the I'm a senior uh, manager purchasing in Heidelberger Druckmaschinen AG, but with our subsidiary Amplified, we support uh, their uh, e-mobility business. Mm -hmm. And in case of this Connect Home project, together with Mr. Seubert, it was our um, task to support in the concept, in the mm -hmm. design and the realization phase. Okay. So where's, where's the similarity between printing machines and wall boxes, actually? Is there some components are similar? Or how do I have yeah. to imagine this? Yeah, yeah, that's an often asked question. Mm -hmm. um, there, is, um, there is one core we, we share with the printing presses and the e-mobility product, mm -hmm. and this is the control and power electronic inside. Okay. We do the development and the production of these um, circuit boards. We do by ourselves in our plant in uh, Wiesloch Waldorf. Oh. So in order to step into new promising fields of business, um, beside the main business, Heidelberg decided to use these um, years of experience to shift it into that immobility e market. And you actually have a, quite a strong market position already, right? Yes, we have in the printing um, press mm -hmm. market and we have it also with the, um, with the, um, with the charging docks. Mm -hmm. yeah? This is around about 20%. Okay. And this is, this is quite, quite nice, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I see you're happy. I yeah. think you're happy yes, about I that. Yes, I am. Uh. Um, uh, Jochen, um, we're going to talk about the materials, actually, also, that, that are used in this Connect Home wall box. How are they different from other wall boxes? Yeah, in this case, uh, we had been a uh, request from Heidelberger, uh, which had been uh, in the first step on a very high level, mm -hmm. yeah? Mm -hmm. And then uh, when problems occur during the processing on an existing mold, yeah, mm -hmm. then we had a look uh, to a new material. Mm -hmm. And uh, with this uh, new request, uh, we also took the opportunity not only to look on technical requests, so we also looked on the commercial issue. Mm -hmm. And what had been very important the last years, we looked also uh, on availability. Yeah. Yeah. Um. During um, the uh, huge impact in the E&E &E industry, mm -hmm. it's very difficult to supply the flame retardant market. Mm -hmm. And therefore, I think we found the best solution for Heidelberger. Okay, I got two more questions on that. I mean, first of all, the flame retardancy topic. Why is that important for a wall box? Yeah, when you have electrical connection, mm -hmm. yeah, there's every time a risk of a bad uh, wire connection mm -hmm. where this wire can get to very because uh, when there's a, there's a current and there can come a lot of energy on a, a small surface and with this high energy you have the risk that the plastic isolation material can ignite, that the okay. flame mm -hmm. is going uh, on and we have to ensure when this ignition is away, uh, that the flame is going out in some time. Mm -hmm. yeah? mm -hmm. And this is a request to all electrical installations. And therefore, uh, we tried to get even the norm, but not more as the norm really requires. Um, Alexander, if I understand Jochen correctly, BASF basically jumped in when there was an issue uh, with, with another supplier. Um, but since then, it has developed further, right, yeah, the cooperation. Yeah. Tell me something more about that. Yeah, yeah. We were already in business with BASF for an automotive application, mm -hmm. for a charging application. Mm -hmm. We started in 2014. Mm -hmm. There was contact by phone, email, and face-to-face. -face. Also technical support directly at the injection molding machine. 
but we thought about to, to start that project uh, without BASF mm -hmm. and um, <laughs> made the decision. To Never a good idea, uh, yeah. by the way. We learned, yeah. Um, and uh, <laughs> chose a product of a competitor, yeah. And mm -hmm. uh, when we had the first of tool parts, we were faced with some real serious issues. We couldn't fix by the machining parameters. We couldn't fix by simulations mm -hmm. or by any tricks in the tool. Mm -hmm. So we remembered Mr. Seubert and um, we made a phone call. Please help us. Yeah? Mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, yeah. I think that's, that's a good thing uh, is to come into, uh, into a relationship. Mm -hmm. yeah? mm -hmm. This is very, very important. And in this case, uh, when uh, the first project uh, we talked together where problems occurred, it had been a surface problem, and therefore we were able to deliver, to deliver in a very short time a sample to be really to solve the problem because mm -hmm. it uh, had been a problem in the current series. Yeah? And then it's important to be very fast on the one hand, and we even supported the molding trials mm -hmm. at, uh, at the molder yeah, uh, to get a best result with this alternative material. And so we were able to solve the problem. And then we get in contact and afterwards with the next problem or the next project. Yeah, we are very happy to have a collaboration. You need problems to solve, <laughs> <Yes>. apparently. <laughs> but, but tell me something about the, the material is mainly in the housing, right? It's about the housing. Is this polyamide or what? any specific features of the material? Yes, we have uh, some uh, special requests. Uh, uh, we talk about the black uh, part of the housing part. This, this, this one. Is, uh, more where yeah. you can see as normal customer mm -hmm. just the side wall. Yeah? In mm -hmm. front, it, it's a glass part. Yeah? Mm -hmm. And the surrounding is an amorphous material. Yeah? And uh, even on the side, you see it by your eyes. And the surface has to be uh, on a very good quality level. And therefore, we provided a material based on glass fibers in combination with glass beads. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the, the requirement list for this material, it's, it's quite long. Okay. And there, there are points which are um, independent from each other. Mm -hmm. There are points which are contrary to each other. Okay. Mm -hmm. So the list is so long. Yeah? Mm -hmm. And there was also impact strength. There was uh, stiffness. There is optical uh, appearance. There is so many. Mm -hmm. They are to find the right material to fulfill the requirements, to be available and to be okay in pricing. That's, that's yeah. the challenge. Yeah. <coughs> and Richard, in the first step, uh, we provided four materials mm -hmm. as possible alternative. We all molded them by injection molding trials. Mm -hmm. uh, but after we had the parts, then we had a look to the parts, and then we decided to choose one material uh, with where we went into the tests. Mm -hmm. yeah. Alexander, um, you, you mentioned your um, quite pleasant market position that you already have for those wall boxes. Um, describe a little bit for, for our audience here the, uh, the way that the market has developed in the past couple of years and your expectation for the future. Is it all going up because everybody's talking about having such a thing in his home? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, there are new, uh, new requirements securing. Yeah? Uh, in the beginning, this was only charging. Yeah. Plug in and charge the car. And uh, actually, there is a demand that you have an, that you have an app. We have a My Amplified app mm -hmm. where you can have control. Is this, what's this for? Yeah, this is the RFID card. Okay. Mm -hmm. You have uh, the authorization for a single or for various users. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah? And with the My Amplified app, you can have the uh, uh, um, a control monitoring issues, mm -hmm. functions of the box. Yeah? Mm -hmm. And it can be also included in your home energy management system. So these are features which came up in the last years, and mm -hmm. uh, this Connect Home is the answer to that. Mm -hmm. And the, the way forward, from your point of view, will this yeah. business field become ever bigger? Yeah, yeah. yeah for sure. This is, um, this is the new generation we, we have um, mm -hmm. implemented, and there will be new features mm -hmm. uh, within that platform. Uh, such as integration to a backend mm -hmm. or for an optimal use of your self-generated solar power. Ah, okay, okay. So um, this is already on the market since when, actually? Yeah, it's uh, quite new. Mm -hmm. uh, point of sale was beginning of October. Oh, okay, that was yesterday, basically. <laughs> okay. yeah. And we are now in mass production, everything runs stable. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
That's we are proud of the requirements we have fulfilled, but also when you look at it, and this is maybe about BSF material, we think it's also a real beauty. We are, we are proud of it. That's it. I mean, it's actually, if, if you have one of these pieces in your home, you also want it to look good. It's also a yeah. design piece, not just functional, yeah? yeah? Is this where the materials kick in? Yes. Mm -hmm. um, to get this very good surface, it's very important to have the right uh, molding parameters. Mm -hmm. yeah? mm -hmm. And therefore, BSF provides a technical service. There are some guys just doing molding trials mm -hmm. uh, at the customers, at the molders, and to support them and to get the maximum out of the material. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, we're talking a lot about you know, global cooperations, and these are also two kind of big players working together. But Interestingly, you're also neighbors, so to say. So the two companies are neighbors. Uh, tell us about how that helped in the cooperation. Does it make it easier or no matter where you are, we always do that? Yeah, the locations nearby allowed a, a real quick alignment. Mm -hmm. yeah, the BASF in Ludwigshafen, our injection molding partner Akko in Hoffenheim. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. And we in Wislach waldorf this was quite close. Mm -hmm. So um, there, in a very short time, we could build up... Um, a very efficient and reliable collaboration, which is really highly appreciated by all the three partners. Mm. Yeah. Even being as a global company, there is an advantage. Yeah? If we have a such regional triangle uh, working together, mm. uh, everybody understands even the means between the words. Mm -hmm. yeah? Yeah. And this helps really in such a collaboration. Yeah? And we get, the, at uh, the end of the day, we get a huge benefit out of this. Yeah. And the collaboration was not only theoretical by exchanging data sheets or yeah, something, yeah. it was uh, practically directly on the machine. Yeah, because you also have to look at prototypes, yeah, at molds, and, and check the quality and the surface. Exactly. exactly yeah. Right. Yeah. Um, Jochen, one more question to you. Um, we do have quite a few electric cars at Ludwigshafen site, the yeah, biggest chemical site in the world. Is there any plan to install these war boxes at our production sites? Yes, yes, there are, there are plans um, to install these um, Heidelberger wall boxes. Mm -hmm. um, but to now, there's no decision made because it's a relatively complex, um, um, complex device. Um, we have over 40,000 employees on the site, mm -hmm. and there we have a request to a lot of complex um, wall boxes we need, because there are even third parties, and we have to check about this, and uh, Heidelberg will even make an update uh, of their wall boxes, which they are already uh, launched, mm -hmm. and after these updates, we might have the technical approval to install even these wall boxes on the BSF site in Ludwigshafen. Okay. I keep my fingers crossed. I want to see more of these uh, beautiful pieces in my neighborhood, Alexander and Jochen. Thank you very much for giving us insights into the Connect Home wall box made with BASF materials. Fantastic goal creation, fantastic example on our plastics journey. You will still be around for a couple of minutes here, yes. or maybe for a couple of days. Have a good day. Thank you all. Thank you. Bye-bye. BASF. We create chemistry.